Oh, let's do it. So we got um, our part done, right? But we need to assemble it so that we can see interaction. So we're going to go plus sign down in the bottom right or left. And I've already got mine. You should already have one because it's by default you get one, but we're going to start with a blank screen. First thing we need to do is bring in, insert our part. And I'm going to click on part one here, bring that in. While we're here, let's just go ahead and bring in my other parts. These are both exactly the same, so I'll just bring in two of those and then this guy. And we're done bringing in parts. Don't click the X, I do that sometimes. So when we are assembling again, we need to make sure that one part is not going to move. This one, I'm going to lock this in. This is going to be our foundation. Right click and then fix it. Okay, you can see the icon pop up. When I try and move it, this icon pops up right here and tells me I can't move it. Now let's assemble some pieces, huh? So on this one right here, we want it to have a slider mate. We're going to have it slide in that slot. And so if I take and hover right up here, I've got a slider mate right there. And I'm going to click on this corner right here. But when I do so, I want to make sure that the arrow is going the correct way. So again, depending where you hover, um, I want that arrow going down and to the right. So I'm going to come from this edge and go there because that's the edge I want to slide along. And then it's going to attach to this edge right here. So let's get down there. I went from that edge point right there and came out to the end. Okay. And now we've got it right there. And we're good to go. One thing that's kind of nice so we can see how it's going to function. We can click the play button and it will slide in and out of that spot. We can put limits on it so make sure it's only going to slide a certain distance, but it's not going to matter because it will be constrained with our um, center points of the circle. So I'm going to go ahead and click that check. And now that it is in there, I can slide it around. And it's stuck in that slot. And, but it doesn't have limits on it. And it'll just go however. All right, let's get our next one. Let's go S. And we're doing our slider again. And then I got from that edge, blue line is pointing down into the left, if I do it correctly. And then it's going to go in this slot right here. And it should be going out to my right. Okay. Got that one. Again, if it's uh, you did every, the clicks correctly, sometimes it might be reversed or it might be spun, something like that. So if you got it right, maybe, maybe you just need to click around and make sure it's rotated or flipped over to the correct side. We're good to go there. Verify its function. It's working. Okay. We'll bring these ones in. Now let's attach these to that. So that one, we're going to use a different constraint right here. It's called a revolute mate because they're going to revolve around each other. And I'm going right to the center point of this circle and it's pointed up. I want to go to the bottom of this and make sure the blue line is pointed down. Okay. And let's see where we're at. Okay. looks like it's connected correctly. Let's see how it's going to function. All right. It's, it's going to work there. So now we just got to connect these other two. I'm going to bring it out here so I can see it. So I can see that bottom part is what I need. So I need right here. That circle is going to be connected to this circle. And it, it looks like it messed up, but it's only going to connect those back together after I push this green checkbox. And now it is working. Check that out. So now let's verify. And how long should you verify for? Oh, oh until you're confident that it's functional. I, I think I need to reset my computer. It should be smoother than this. <laughs> Which is fine. Ooh, and we see a little collision there. So I would need to shorten these parts for this thing to be like full on working. Oh yeah, there's a little collision right there. So I would need to shorten my parts. Alrighty. Good work. We got it done. Enjoy your day. Catch you later.